free. And apparently I'm running using these things. Okay, that, that's fine by me. Okay, this what is... What is this frame rate? Holy um, shit. Coming up, Tunnel Rats by Cotty. Back home, I used to hate weed. Thought it was just hippie shit. And I would have never dreamed of going to a hooker. Just one week in country, and the good old USA and Julianne seem like a dream. Maybe it's that Cambodian gold shit I smoked, or whatever Drake called it. That stuff's evil, man. I ain't doing that again. No, man. This is the dream. Right here. That's how to play it. Computer is not helping with playing this game because it's running at like 15 FPS and I'm... The audio is still coming from that computer, by the way. Yeah, we're still getting uh, audio from Hitman. <laughs> Which we might as well kill, by the way. Yeah, yeah. It should be. On the stream, it? Yeah. Because Tunnel Rats is an amazing game and it runs amazingly well on all computers. Mm -hmm. uh, at least at 8 FPS. By any chance? Uh, there should be audio. It's plugged in. So. Make sure that it's actually not outputting to HMI or some bullshit like that. Actually, uh, yeah, the speakers. Are there. What is this? Yeah, see, it's outputting to non-speakers. Oh yeah. Can I have the mouse yeah. for a sec? Enjoy. <laughs> That's a long mouse. Uh, that is disabled. Uh, hold on. Make that full. So we're getting ready for the tunnel rats, where a lot of tunnel rats will meet with strange accidents. Ah uh, no. Then again, it's. Should there be some? Yeah, there should be some ambient music. Is it like is the game supposed to make sounds? Yeah. Is this the sound plug? Yeah, no. Okay. It's going into here. Did you check the audio options? Yeah, it's all good. Oh, there are no there. audio options. <laughs> Hold on. Wait. Then this, somebody unplug this. Then, like that's most like maybe <laughs> there we go. Yeah, there's the audio. All right. So three, two, one, go. <laughs> yep. Bit of background this game. Um, Uwe Boll is an amazing man great human being who directs amazing movies, including such classics as uh, House of the Dead and Postal. And at one point he just decided to, that hey, he doesn't want to do any more uh, video game adaptations, so he just made a movie and then made a video game of that movie to complete the circle. And Tunnel Rats is the result of that project. And it's... Yeah. That it was just hippie shit. It's Uwe Ball quality. I would have never dreamed of going to a hooker. Just one week in country, and the good old USA and Julianne seem like a dream. Maybe it's that Cambodian gold shit I smoked, or whatever Drake called it. That stuff's evil, man. I ain't doing that again. No, man. This is the dream. Right here. That's how to play it. That's how to survive and rotate back to the real world. That hooker wasn't real. This mission ain't real. No jungle, no captured GIs, no leech infested mud with VC above and below.
So what can you tell about hey, the story of this game? You got all <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm not sure, I don't really see a lot of it. <laughs> I'm hopefully gonna force someone to play this, like on the bonus stream or something. So I take it this is one of those completely legit speedruns where you don't, like, you know, glitch out the game? Or oh yeah, or totally not, totally not. I mean, it's probably far too solid to glitch anyway. I mean, I bet there's like maybe, maybe the odd visual glitch if you've got a really crappy PC. Yeah, sometimes uh, someone's hand might flip into a wall. Just a tiny bit, that's it. Just the visual thing then. Yeah, oh, nothing okay. major. That should be good. The FPS uses are quite, like, you know, bad and broken, but it sounds pretty solid. Oh yeah, this is a masterpiece. No kidding. Uh, this cutscene is like, I think, about three minutes. Completely unskippable. Something like that. Two, three minutes. And at the beginning I of course can't see anything. But I can still control my character, so... You can kind of see around the edges what's going on. Let's see. So in case you weren't sure the name of the game, it's Tunnel Rats. <laughs> okay. Okay, am I going the wrong... Yes, I'm going the right direction. Oh my god, this frame rate! Well, it's more than 8, I'll give it that. <laughs> Most computers were just giving us 8 frames per second. It is gonna be difficult. Like, actually difficult. Sorry, dude. I'm gonna need that. What the hell? It it runs on this computer. That is the best we can do. Some Drake disarm one of these once. I hope it's easier than it looks. Yeah. Dead? Yeah. Also, this flashlight is completely open. I'm just getting it because it might be a painful to watch and play. Else? But yeah, this game isn't broken they at all. Go. Hold on. Tunnel entrance. Pitch black down here. Oh, come on. Let my eyes adjust to the there we go. Careful now. Just some minor graphic graphical Thank glitches. God. Well, this game is this gonna be actually really well, difficult with this frame rate. Long before I turn around the corner. So I didn't open my notes beforehand. That's gonna be a real issue. All right, so I believe it's this corner right here that I use as a setup. There are some odd things in the distance. Don't mind them. <laughs> Just a visual glitch. Yeah, a visual glitch. Never mind that. Like sometimes the level just doesn't load properly. It's normal. So, Kossi, when did the glitches start? Um, I don't know. We'll see in a moment, I guess. Okay. There's the exit trigger for the level. Hopefully I can find it. It's a bit difficult to navigate this. That actually what? says end on it. Yes, it does. <laughs> okay, there we go. There should be some ammo and medkit over here. I hope I can find them. So yeah, there they are. And there should be a checkpoint, yes. And now I just gotta find the exit point. There's also gonna be an enemy there, who I cannot see. <laughs> there we go. I would like to his like to grab his ear. Oh, nice. <laughs> there we go. Just took an invisible Viet Cong ear. That's chapter one. That's, That's like one of the chapters with more gameplay on it. Chapter two is. It has a minor glitch in it. Just one minor glitch. You showed that box who's boss. Yeah, like... Just gonna turn left and jump. Whoops. <laughs> Enjoy the scenery. Oh, again some boxes. Yeah, the... For some reason you can jump up some of these bushes. Like, it's completely random which ones you can jump up. And... They are pretty rare. Like, when I was routing this game, I pretty much had to jump jump against every single bush in the game. <laughs> Which is, in case of in case of this game, every single wall. <laughs> Luckily, in most cases, the bushes were right at the beginning, like here. But there were some levels where I really had to look for them. <laughs> some random smoke over there. No, not sure what that is. Probably just a minor visual glitch. Yeah, minor visual glitch, of course. 
Okay, then I'm going to jump down here and here. I'm not supposed to get stuck there. Okay. Down. There we go. And level X is somewhere in here. There we go. <laughs> I see why they call this game Tunnel Rats. Yeah. So many tunnels so far. In Chapter 3 you're going to see some amazing Viet Cong trap design. You can already see it in the distance. Actually, you can see it right here. I'm being punished. Nice. But it's that is the real amazing up. trap. That's why Ford is dead. Like, is that is dangerous. He told me it was nothing. <laughs> it was what everyone did. <laughs> Buying a beer. Ouch. Wow, it's like really <laughs> dangerous. <laughs> Too quiet. Charlie should have been here by now. Yep. Yeah. Oh, it's this frame rate. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually making this game really difficult. And hey, here's a bush. Someone, Amazing trap design again. So, someone in chat says these glitches are awesome, but I think I've, I've seen one or two minor like visual bugs, but I don't <laughs> think I've seen any real glitches. Have you? No, no. It's just normal gameplay. All right. This level is a bit difficult because I've been unable to find a consistent setup for the. That was a minor visual glitch, by the way. <laughs> Find the actual exit in this level. It's somewhere in this area. But there are also some tunnels which I might fall into. Let's see. Oh, should be close. Come on. Please. It's in this area. Oh, I don't want to be this low. That's probably too low. There we go. <laughs> Normal gameplay, right there. Chapter 4 is... Oh yeah, just a broken one. Crouch in high grass to move around and see. <laughs> I don't think that mechanic actually works. <laughs> Keep going. Anything. <laughs> Keep heading oh no, an enemy! <laughs> you die! Demons, these <laughs> Uh, well, the, there are just about two people in this world who have played this game. Those are me and Adam. Yeah. Yeah, everybody at ESA runs this game. <laughs> well, I'm gonna make someone play this on bonus stream. Again. What, like a blind? Black shrimp. Yes, blind. <laughs> I reckon Trip Rose would be up for it. Blind. Amazing scenery once again. Also, oh, this is like chapter 4, I at the moment have a knife and one gun with no ammo. <laughs> Just gotta be careful not to walk on the map, because I don't want to be there. Makes things difficult. Especially since the exit trigger is quite high up over there in that building. Which I can enter, to, enter through the ceiling like that. You can kind of skip this cutscene, but... Uh, it's a really difficult setup and it might softlock the level. <laughs> also, it shows you the antagonist of the game. Like, he looks really mean. So what's the story again? Uh, I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, I got an interesting $5 donation from Zubaxel. Uh, did I need psycho I'd need psychotropics to enjoy <laughs> tunnel rats, but Cotty sedating me with it. I stayed up all night to see you fail House of Cards again. <laughs> Have a great day. Donate to whoever. On level 5, I'm gonna turn left and I'm gonna jump. Why do I keep hesitating? I can't change Whoops. my mind all the time. I'll yeah, I gotta go east. east. What's the base? Uh, if only I had a compass. <laughs> Not sure what that is. <laughs> The audio setup. Yeah. <laughs> I found SWAT 4. <laughs> you found the trailer for SWAT 4? <laughs> the scenery so for this level is really for amazing. Like an hour. I'm liking this. It's beautiful. There's a message for someone. Someone just said he's played over a thousand hours of this game. Yeah, uh, sure. Does I have. <laughs> so plausible. <laughs> yeah. 
I wish I had a gun. I wish I had grenades, because grenades in this game are... ...well made. Like, from my experience, they only work if you throw them from out of bounds. <laughs> <laughs> I, I tried using them normal in normal gameplay and they just wouldn't blow up. Then I went out of bounds and they suddenly started working. <laughs> Do you ever actually kill something? In yes, the in the next level, they actually. the box in the first <laughs> level. <laughs> so there's a Vietnamese hey, water trap. Killed an invisible boss. I mean, that's, yeah, that's hard. Just checkpoint. With a knife. There we go. Can I find it? Come on. Come on, checkpoint. Yeah, it's actually the level exit. I just had to find it. And Cosy, so is this Wolfenstein 3D? Let me just check. No, it's the new Wolfenstein. Oh, okay. Come on, where's the level exit? Should be right about here. Let's get a bit of distance to it. Try again. Approach it from right about here, I guess. That looks good. There we go. <laughs> there are some in invisible tunnels I might fall into, so... it's It can be tricky to find all those triggers. Like, it was interesting looking for all the all the setups. And there's the bad guy again, doing absolutely nothing, being important. And actually, chapter 7, which is the following one. <laughs> yeah, this game is self-aware. The, fir the first chapter is called Waking Up to a Nightmare. <laughs> can't have just now you're actually going to see some tunnels. Day. Maybe there is no this one. Uh, right there, Maybe went right through the wall. <laughs> they come in and out through the walls. Don't, Don't like mind that. them. There. Seen wow, this yeah. tunnel are going to be so painful with this <laughs> one. Right. Enemies! <laughs> come on! There we go, thank you. I'm going to steal all the ears from these enemies, because that might give me more health. I'm... I'm uh, yeah, it should give me more health. I'm sure, I guess I eat those arrows or something. I don't know. So, Kotti, is it true that you've got a shrine to do a bowl in your room? Yes, it is true. Okay. And and so is that where the ears go? Do you sacrifice the ears to him there? <laughs> mm, yeah. I I suppose you can say that. Fine. Yeah, you gotta I be real. That. You gotta be real careful in these tunnels because. Answer me, God. Oh yeah. Uh, did the just others pray to get home safe too? Wait, what was that? Turn a cold shoulder on them when they begged for your help with their faces turned into grimaces of pain? Or do you just not give a shit? You're just like the old man. I'm supposed to be grateful because you put me on this earth and I do everything to please you. It's a deep game. But you treat me like shit when I really need I wish I could show you more I of this. I can do without that. I can do without you. Alright, now that we can see, we can see some more amazing Vietnamese trap design. It's a snake on a stick. <laughs> and no, there's gonna be another snake on a stick right here. Right there. <laughs> the snake is an insta kill. If you walk into it, it's gonna poison you and you die immediately. Now, this is awesome frame rate. Also, keep mashing the jump because this game likes to eat your jumps. So come on, go down there. Oh, come on. Where is it? Nice aim. Oh, my. Doing doing <laughs> yeah. The game is self aware, I told you. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Tunnel Rats 2014. <laughs> I'm I'm gonna die in this game. I'm not sure if I can beat level seven with this frame rate. Like that's, that's an actual concern right now. God, this is level six. Well, might as well accept the fact that I'm all alone. So pay attention to the it's just monologue. My gun, it's amazing. VC between here and home. And coming up is the most difficult trick in the game, and I'm not kidding. It's actually quite difficult. At least I'm used to doing it at, l at a low frame rate because the game almost always uh, runs up, runs really poorly here. So I'm gonna have to. I like okay, the way jump from this rock on that wall. Oh, didn't quite get it first try. Try again. 
need some speed because the game eats jumps. No. So probably better off dying at this point because I would like to have those medkits in the next level. Uh, oh! Overshot. Well. There's some more Vietnamese traps, some sticks. I, I, like, I like the way that they've got the color of the sky completely accurate to real life. Yeah, yeah. Just that attention to detail, really. They were paying attention to minor details. Like frame rate. Come on, let's make this jump. Is that it? It's not it. Damn it. I'd like to have all the medics I can have in the next level. Nope, it's not happening. I want at least one medkit to kind of kill me. Thanks. Give me your medkit, thank you. How am I doing on ammo, by the way? Okay, seven bullets and fourteen. Actually. Jump! Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna try it. Even if I lose all my medkits. No. This framer is not making it any easier. It's usually low in this level, but not this low. Like, there's something about this area just that just cripples the game. No. Mm, the rock. Oh my god. <laughs> if only I could air spray. Just get up there. No. I need at least some health because there's gonna be a drop drop soon after this uh, trick. Also, before anyone says it would be fast to do it normally, no, it wouldn't because I have no clue what, what where to go from here. <laughs> like, this is the normal route. It, it is completely intended. Also, didn't pick up the medkits. So, Kotsi, when's the um, 10 player co op for this? What? It's 10 player co op. 10 player co op? Uh, we can do that in bonus stream. <laughs> You're in. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> no, please let me make this jump. It's a difficult jump, but not that difficult. Oh my god. Yeah. You made it. Yeah, I made it once and. All I have to do is jump up the wall. How hard is that? Get up there! Get up there! Don't fall off. This is getting ridiculous. <laughs> I should have just run this at the 8 FPS computer. It wouldn't, wouldn't be much worse. Did it actually run the game or did it just crash? Uh, it actually ran the game at 8 FPS, I think. Oh, fuck! Yeah, yeah, it kind of is. <laughs> like, it doesn't help that the game already eats like half the chumps I do. Whenever I jump, I double the tap space because I get I just cannot trust. Like, whoa, 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 whoa! There was some major input lag right there. I don't know why it wasn't there before. All right, finally, we in there. And the question is, can I do chapter seven with this health? With no medkits. 
because I'm gonna lose that much health. And of course, because the level designers are really nice people, there's one more trap right here. There. The traps are almost invisible in these later levels. Killed. <laughs> oh, eight. Killed enemies and have, then I have infinite time to do the jumps. Yeah, I have 14 bullets and there are more than 14 <laughs> enemies in there. And it's gonna take more than one one shot per enemy. Per enemy. Pretty much guaranteed. Okay. Bottles of hell. <laughs> now so, things get difficult. So, Kotti, I never really learned much um history um to be honest so is this basically how the vietnam war was won because uh, we did win that didn't we <laughs> oh yeah this is historically completely accurate so i should play this game and learn some history oh yeah you're in 10 pellet crop it's happening okay gotta be really careful in this area because i don't have much ammo to spare and this frame rate doesn't make aiming any better. But you do realize you need to thank you for the ten computers. I'll put these in a package and mail them. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's where it's gonna fail. I'm gonna just have to play this level quite safely. Especially since my notes are somewhere else. Ta-da! Ta -da. Oh, there's a snake. <laughs> Forgot about that one. That's why I usually have notes for this level, because it's a long and complex tunnel system. And memorizing it is just... just about impossible. Oh god. Don't kill me. Thank you. I'm gonna loot everything I can, because... This game doesn't give you enough ammo for anything. I'd like to have your gun too, if you would give it to me. Oh! Actually, I'm gonna reset this more from uh, menu, because I just realized how this glitch works, and why this level seems so difficult at some time, sometimes. Because once you pick up a weapon from an enemy, he doesn't drop it again. Even if you, <laughs> even if you die. So I was never gonna get my rifle back. <laughs> and I'm... I'm not sure how doable this level is without the rifle. Like, I, I've done that before, but it's taking a very long time. Because I have to knife a lot of enemies. Yeah, he's not dropping the gun anymore. That's cool. I get more of these than dog tags if we're winning, right? I think the grenade traps are the only trap in the game that isn't insta kill, because that's fair level design. Another snake. Also, checkpoints are usually right after insta kill traps, like this one, <laughs> right after the snake. Also, these tunnels are not as small as they seem. I mean, you can do a full 360 in them. <laughs> so I'd like to know who actually places a grenade in like that in a tunnel like this. Supposedly the Viet Cong actually used these tunnels for something. Just how many of them die, die on a daily basis to their own traps? If I get more of these than dog tags, it means we're winning, Hello. right? Yeah, this computer. I'm terrified. It's ass. Yeah, I might be a pussy pops, but I ain't gonna get thrown out of the army. We all know that's what really happened to you. Frick. It sucks when you've got just a brilliant game and you can't play it to its full potential because the computer is subpar. Yeah, yeah. Sick of this shit. Mom just gotta like steal everyone's ears. Hated guns fighting in war. How the hell did they both Even if they don't have heads anymore.
Also, I'm mashing F all the time because it reveals traps, like this. <laughs> so I won't walk into them. I think this is the best checkpoint in the game. You didn't just see out of bounds. There's another checkpoint right there. <laughs> well placed. I think there's a Vietnamese water trap coming up. I'm not sure, quite sure how it works. You can try to figure it out. It's also really dangerous. Oh no! I'm drowning. Yeah, still drowning. Actually, never mind. Just walk out. Still gotta be really careful with all the traps on, on the ground. So I don't want to walk into one. Hello. That one was really poorly hidden. Okay, I don't remember which way to go because I don't have my notes. Okay, that's all the question. Luckily the dead ends are really early on. And I think there's some amazing cutscenes coming up again. She must have been real impressed with those hippies so let them brainwash her like that. But by, by the way, guys, you're not dropping frames. This is all intended. <laughs> Please drop your acid now. I'll put these in a package and mail them to that. It's the room I'm thinking of. Good. I'm still on the map. Good, I found the trap. I also don't mind the rats running through walls. It's normal. <laughs> also this... yeah. <laughs> you can just peek out of walls. <laughs> in specific locations. Yeah, you just gotta make sure that you know everything's in its right place. Another water trap. So dangerous. Never mind, really. <laughs> you can try to figure out how that water gets there. Doesn't matter, we all know it's not dangerous unless you hear the drowning music from Sonic. <laughs> oh yeah, it's gonna be a boss fight. Dead. Looks like some kind of wild animal killed. So one more trap before a checkpoint, because you better have that. Where is it? It's gonna be a trap. I remember this trap because I've fallen into it like 15 times. There we go. And checkpoint right after it. Because fair game, fair design. Where are those fucking gooks? Congratulations, uh, you didn't fall into the trap. Here's a checkpoint. <laughs> yep. And here's a boss fight. I'm gonna jump down to the toilet. Whoop. And I'm still in control. I can only do jumps, but. Oh, don't kill me, please. Hello, boss. I think my gun is back down and it's not actually shooting. Please die. Thanks. Yeah! Again, I'm stealing all the ears. This is a long level. Yeah, this level is like longer than rest of the levels combined. <laughs> yeah, yeah, easy. Like, if anyone finds a way to go out of bounds in a tunnel, please let me know. Please break this game. I've been trying, I can't do it. Well, I think if anybody finds a way to go out of bounds anywhere, then it'll be a massive achievement. Oh yeah, true. So well this is so glitless. I think that achievement would be getting the game wrong. <laughs> yeah.
Oh, these tunnel rats are exceptionally tall and trigger happy. And they appear to have opposable thumbs. Give me all the ears. I need my health. Because this is the Mike Tyson book, Bushwalking Tunnel Snake Simulator 2014. I believe there's one more trap in the level. Yes. And the rest should be just running. Oh, no oh, cocaine for you. Oh yeah, it's this room. You gotta be kidding. You gotta be fucking kidding. Indeed. <laughs> <laughs> really don't want you to go there. <laughs> no, and they really don't want to go there by themselves. Uh, Kobol, you you can't eat the rice that they dropped. You can only no. eat the ears. I I did say it was the last trap, and I was awfully wrong because I forgot this section exists. But it, from this point on, the level gets easier, and the traps are way more obvious, like that one. Like, usually if I have a trouble with this level from this point on, it's because I'm out of ammo, and that happens because the game glitches out sometimes. Like, right now I have plenty of ammo, I can just spray and pray. Mostly, mostly pray because this frame rate is so bad. I can't get into this tunnel. I'd like to disarm a grenade trap so that I actually get the grenade from it, but I'm scared to fuck it up with this frame rate. So Kotsu, your view account is higher for this than it was for Hitman, proving yes. that this is a better game. Yes, as also if look we need proof. It should be running at me, I hope. Well, you're on just over 3,000 viewers. Come on, rats. Come at me. Oh, Usually they run right through me. Because the tunnels are really wide. I believe. This is the right way, yes. Ears, thank you. Yeah, wanna kill me. I'll put these in a package and mail them to that OG Min. Where is the trap? Oh, never mind, it's a water trap coming up next. That's dangerous. <gasps> oh, and actually it put me over here. Okay, so we're gonna... I have to play the final chapter from a replay chapter as well. The final one is... special. <laughs> I'm yeah, the, the game is self-aware. I'm glad we're getting a special level, because all the others are just so ordinary. What do no, I have a no shotgun? I'm not supposed to have a shotgun. There goes your ammo. <laughs> yeah, there goes my ammo, indeed. I guess I'll deal with the shotgun then. Man, it's powerful. Give me the, my proper pistol bag. The one which, which has ammo. I believe the last level has like no traps. And if there are any, it's like water traps which are incredibly dangerous. Oh no. He has a machete. And there's a proper gun. Thank you. Ouch. Go away, yes. please. Yes! Yes! <laughs> yes! Um, anyone got some tissues? No, it's a fairly short one. It also has no traps, so uh, that would realistically kill me. So it's a lot easier. So I don't have to be careful here. I can just run through and nothing's gonna kill me. That wasn't out of bounds right there. Don't worry about it. Do you read me, Blackwood? This is Alpha oh yeah, cutscenes. So now the tunnel is gonna blow up. I'm gonna look this for medkits. Oh yeah, this tunnel is way bigger than it looks, so I can just feed right through here. Hello. Amazing 
explosions. Alright, now it's just the final fight left. I'm not gonna be using this awful, awful AK. Totally not eating my jumps. <laughs> And now the twist. I've been trying to locate my uh, my buddies, and now I finally find them. And what happens? There they are. Bye. And that's the bad guy again. It's really difficult to kill. It's plenty of HP. No idea what they're actually doing here. Just chilling. Just gonna grab this flamethrower right here. Where's the flamethrower? What? Nope! What? I'm pretty sure there weren't any flamethrowers in that war. There's a flamethrower here! <laughs> There's no flamethrower, Johnny! <laughs> what?! <laughs> Not in the, on this PC. <laughs> Go on, Cotty, do, do it properly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there we go! <laughs> I was gonna say, man mode activated. These flames are pretty amazing. They just sometimes get stuck in the air like that. <laughs> <laughs> that is completely normal. Does that actually do damage? Uh, sadly, no. Come on. Yeah. I probably already killed the main bad guy. <laughs> Difficult to tell. Because the flamethrower just one shots everything. I'd like to get some medkits in here. There should be a bunch lying around. There's one. Oh, there's some flames. <laughs> and there's some more... Oh my god, there's plenty of flames this time around. <laughs> and the practice run I did just before this, I got like no flames, but now there's just stuck everywhere. It's fine by me. Like, again, wow! <laughs> Keeps happening. Yeah, I'm trying to find some medkit real quick here. There should be a bunch lying around in the ruins. Yeah, yeah, you can't see shit. <laughs> everything's on fire. Yeah. Did you have to kill all of them? Yeah. Uh, the level is ending when uh, the main character says something smart, meaningful. So it ended like 30 minutes ago. <laughs> Is this going to be one of those games where we all learn a valuable lesson about yes, how yes. horrible war is? What, what the lesson is, is you'll find out. We don't know. It's random. There are like, I don't know, five different lines you can say. And these pawns are completely random. I just have to hope, hope I find them. Where are they? They're hiding behind the flames. Yeah, probably. Where are you guys? Maybe we can win the war using the power of friendship. <laughs> that didn't work in Smash. No, but Splash Brothers and Where the, are they? and the Vietnam War, are like, somewhat similar, obviously, but uh... come on now, guys. There we go. Hello. <laughs> and the flames got stuck again. Wow, all these guys are accidentally, spontaneously combusting. Yeah. I guess I'm <laughs> uh, so uh, broken on this computer. Uh, at least you'll get your uh, Silent Assassin award, though. Yeah, totally. Like, I wish there was some kind of way to uh, use the audio to locate them, but even if you have headphones or a can surround sound system, it doesn't help. Mono. Yeah, pretty much. It, I don't think it's mono, but it's not accurate. <laughs> That's probably 
Yeah. I don't know. Who's <laughs> this guy? Why? <laughs> He's only missing one. Who I, knows? Who, who knows? <laughs> They're just hiding in the bushes. <laughs> They're scared of the flame. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They are way smarter than usually. Just burn everything. You'll hit them eventually. Right no. Side. Right side? Did you see one? Uh, hear, hearing doesn't yeah, hear, do hearing doesn't help. The audio cues are wrong. There we go. I think there's one. No, it's just the flames. Where? Uh -oh. There! <laughs> <laughs> there's too, too much flames in this area to see anything. <laughs> like... <laughs> Okay, are they hiding in the ruins? Please, people! Come on now, this is ridiculous. You can hear them, but... There we go! How many of them are there? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Time! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> That was awful. <laughs> also, yeah, you just died in a bombing. So you accomplished absolutely nothing. Yeah, pretty much. So is it time to reload the checkpoint then? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you're in control. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, we have a we have a fancy timer started. Three minutes. Three. We have. Uh, yeah, three, three, three minutes until we get to you your lovely trailer for our next game. Hopefully, under three minutes. Yeah. So, coming up next, we've got a Badox, a hundred percent run by Wary, um, and Wary will be kicking off the uh, the new uh, the next NES block.